I'm going to teach you how to enter a Google Classroom and attach a photo and add a comment. So let's go back into our Google Classroom and this time you're going to enter into your library class. And again, we go to the middle tab to see what our classwork is for today. I can see that it's in blue, which means it's not finished yet and I need to still do it. Again, if you click on the left hand side where you see the three lines or like a stack of pancakes, you can click on the to do button and you'll see all the jobs you have to do for your classes. I can see I have three assignments that I'm still not done with. And if I click on the done tab, I can see that I've done three things already. Let's go back into the library class and find our assignment in classwork. Here, the title says book you are reading. It says practice because this is only for practice. You will not be graded for this. Once I click on this assignment, there should be some instructions from your teacher. Always read the instructions before you get started. So here it asks me, what book are you currently reading? One, upload a picture of the book you are currently reading. Two, make a comment about the book to tell me what it is about. Make sure it is at least two sentences. So now I need to leave the Google Classroom app and I need to take a picture of the book that I'm reading. So I can simply take that picture and now it's in my camera roll. And then I'm gonna go back into my Google Classroom app and see what I can add. So if I slide this up into my work added, I could add an attachment. In here, I could use the camera or I could pick a photo. So I'm gonna pick the photo. Here's the book I am currently reading. And I'm not going to mark done yet because there was a second part of the assignment. Let's go back and look at the instructions together. It says, make a comment about the book and tell me what it is about. So let me go back and now I can add a private comment and I can say, this book is a collection of poems. The poems written are about nature. That is very short for this example. We expect you to have fourth or fifth grade sentences, which may have B compound sentences. Then I can send that comment off and don't forget to turn in your work. Whenever you're using Google Classroom, you must click turn in to make sure that your teacher can see it. Now that is being sent to your teacher and then they can comment back to you. If you are editing a Google Doc and you submit it, you no longer can edit that document. You'll have to click unsubmit to continue to edit. But now in this video, you learned how to add an attachment, which was a photo, and also give a comment to your teacher. All the private comments go to your teacher.